Hey, this is a uh, trailer reaction to the new X Men trailer. X Men Days of Future Past trailer 2. You guys might need headphones for this one. So, yeah. Here we go. So many battles waged over the years. Godzilla. Is it better? What the hell is all purple? Are we destined to destroy each other? Or can we change who we are and unite? Is the future truly set? The stone's going to die. Oh, they're probably going to die. There'll be like a reboot or something. So I been actually going to do this whole shit, and the Sentinels, if I could do this fire thing, but a thousand Sentinels. What the hell was that? That was Sunspot. Really? Yes, that was Sunspot. He was burning, he was destroying the Sentinel. Yeah, the and Colossus was going toe to toe with the Sentinel. I imagine it was almost fucking impossible. Why? He's very metal. What's that? But the Sentinels are too fucking big. Oh, maybe I was kind of like a dog to a human. Maybe, hell. What? Oh, uh, it's, I don't know, it depends, it's really on, I don't know. Uh, so, uh, if, I knew, if I knew it was battling the circle, let's see how I was bothered by X-Men. So, it was the show you all reviewed. Yeah, he's the only one that can take some. Because some of them are, I'm pretty sure some of them are made to be, you know, what, mag non-magnetic. Well, this is possible. Why? Right? In this fucking universe, they make plastic guns. And this new Sentinels are made of, like, I guess, nanomites or something. So... In the yeah. future, though. That is a... Yeah, but he didn't know about the Sentinels back then. And even if he did, he couldn't find all of them. Yeah. I mean, plus the ball for Charles was probably in hiding. Okay, so we're supposed to have a guy. So, it's nothing really making them look more like that. But their powers, I mean. Okay, I don't think Sunspot looks like the freaking Human Torch. What? Does he? No. No? No. No, but he does turn black. What do you use when he heats up? Yeah, but there's like an aura of fire around him. So yeah, that's not entirely wrong. Not entirely. Why don't you want to see how the hell I suppose he's don't actually... Like the mystique transition, though. Wait, Mystique. The Mystique transformation. Yeah. Yeah, it looked like shit. That was like shit. It does look like something out of the fucking, you know, not the, the, the 90s when they had those fucking, like, 3D models that would, yeah. That's what it looked like. Oh, like, well, those test shit. Yeah, that's what it looks like. I don't know. Well, 
So they're probably all gonna die in the future. Wolverine's probably the only one to make it out of there. Because none of them gets in the past, right? It's, it makes sense. Well, no, but they've said immediately what happens in the past does not change the future. Like that. So, who knows, maybe. Wow, well, because the X-Men Apocalypse after this will take place in the 1980s. But what if the next X-Men team has a young Storm, a young Cyclops, a young Jean Grey, like teenagers? Then that would make them really fucking old. Yeah. Hey, so, hey, hey, Halle Berry is like 40, so. But, no. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, it looks fine. It looks fine. Um, I don't know. They might have had too much shit, but. I don't know, either way, it's still gonna be epic. An epic success or an epic fail, it's still gonna work. It's still... Yeah, true, right? It's still gonna be epic, by the way, as a fail or a. or as a win. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, that was our reaction. Hopefully, that was enough of a reaction for you. And I hope you guys check out the movie. <laughs> as usual, if you like it, subscribe, comment, like. If and you don't, don't, please just leave. Fuck off. Yeah. Don't, don't, do that. don't do anything else. Just leave. I just don't. <laughs> okay. although, I, although I can imagine some assholes like, well, since they said that, I might as well comment anyway. Because it's my fucking constitutional right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Anyway, yeah. If you like, like, you hate, fuck off. Thanks. And subscribe. And yeah. Whatever. Bye. Bye.